Hey, well, you're on with Big J. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. But you know what time it is. Spin that intro, and then we will talk. Well, 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 you're on Big J. Big J, let's talk. And what I want to talk about is Andre Drummond. Did the Lakers make the right move? And if they did, did they play him too fast? Seeing that he hasn't played since February. Did they play him too fast? Because what I watched tonight was Giannis putting it to him. He could not deal with Giannis at all. To me, he was actually playing before he got hurt or was already hurt. He was playing like a small forward, not even a power forward. Giannis was just putting work together with him. Let me show you a small clip, and you'll see what I'm talking about as far as the injuries. This third quarter, just a short time. If I was a Lakers fan, watching this would be discouraging. You just won an NBA title last year, two injuries to your major players. Now you bring in a guy who's supposed to be a force down low, um, and he has a major injury because what I read, that toenail is a major injury because it, it could really bother him. With only 25 games left in the regular season, this is concerning. It's very concerning because as you saw tonight, uh, Giannis put in work and no one could do anything. That's why I wonder why didn't they sign JaVale McGee? They didn't need all those other pieces. Just bring McGee back. Something to, something to think about. Well, Lakers, it's on you. Have a good evening. You've been on with Big J.